people are always asking the same question, which is how do I get involved in the cannabis industry in South Africa? Well, if you're not prepared to do the research and spend hundreds of hours going through content and understanding the industry in South Africa, then the very next best recommendation I can make is to attend the Cannabis Expos. This is essentially a four day event where it's hyper condensed with a lot of players from industry networking and discussing the industry and how to move it forward. The best part of it is to see all these businesses that are trying to propel and move the cannabis industry forward. Now, you might not always agree with some of the business activities and ideas. However, when there's 100 exhibitors at an expo, you get to learn quite a lot in a rapid period of time. Now, I've done my best to share on this channel always. But I wanted to take a moment at the expo to interview and give snapshots of what exhibitors were up to, why they were there, and share that with you as an audience. My name is Sleza Laurić. I am from Juicy Fields. We work with medical farms around the world. We still break down the stigmas around the plant. Hello, everybody. Luke Richner here from Cannavigia, coming to you from Cape Town, from the Expo, Cannabis Expo Cape Town, South Africa. Absolutely amazing to see what is happening in the African space. So much dynamic, so many different facets of the industry. And we are Cannavigia, Swiss based, Swiss based compliance software company. What do we do? We do a track and trace, see the sales software, basically cultivation management, manufacturing management, distribution management, with a live audit trail in the back end that allows you to automate your reporting, be it to different regulatory bodies, be it internal or reporting. And the whole thing actually, we're really excited to do more and more here in Africa. Our whole philosophy is, why do you have to capture one-time certification if you can do that all day, every day in a live version? So what we are all about is vigilance beyond certification. Thank you. Hey Jeff, welcome to the Cannabis Expo in Cape Town 2022. Uh, it's Wesley from Bioleaf Technologies and we are just showing off our wares, Lux Lighting, Athena Nutrients, uh, Clean Light Air and Clean Light Pro. And then we've obviously got our Washington uh, uh, Buffett uh, medium specifically designed for cannabis. Uh, but yeah, the key thing here is that everybody is talking about cannabis and the cannabis industry, which is phenomenal. The more we talk about it, the more things uh, people are going to see what it's all about. This is real big business. So you guys must come and support us, support the industry, and yeah, we'll catch you on the flip side.
Good day, welcome to Control Union. We're an auditing body and certifications company and we basically focus on pharmaceutical audits for the cannabis industry and we went into partnership with the Israeli government to create a standard called the Kums Equivalency Standard which we have now gained access to the Israeli markets and it's also important for you to comply to the Kums Equivalency to get access to those markets. Yeah, this is Walter Spiwambata, the CEO of 360 Bar Pharmaceutical, which is the exclusive uh, distributor in the entire Africa uh, for Aeroside. Aeroside is a, uh, a technology, an air purification technology that is effective against eliminating all air pathogens, including viruses, bacteria, molds. Um, and there is a significant relevance why we're here exhibiting at the Cannabis Expo because of its application within the cultivation industry of cannabis, especially for the in -grow, uh, growers which uh, it assists in eliminating the powdery mildew challenges that the, the cultivators are currently facing. Uh, and for more information, please um, um, get into our website, www.aerosideafrica.com. Thank you. Carl from Palm Valley uh, So we do the raised grow beds and grow bags uh, that's made from a geotextile. Uh, our main thing is trying to do it locally, so our fabric is locally made and we also manufacture our products locally. Um, we do anything from the small scale systems to the custom systems for the big more commercial, commercial projects. Um, and yeah, we do most of the wholesale and then distribute to the grow shops um, and then do the direct bigger bulk orders. Yeah. My name is Jean from Bosman Control, South Africa. Uh, Bosman Control is an international company. We, uh, our head office is in Holland. Uh, we uh, do greenhouses, full turn greenhouse solutions um, from heating, cooling, lighting, screening, ventilation, uh, irrigation, fertigation, everything full turn key. Uh, we have the benefit that we engineer, we've got specialists in every field, and we engineer in house. Uh, which then is the, the benefit of the client because integration is key. Uh, we fully support the South African uh, cannabis industry. We are fully behind the industry for quality, quality products. Hi, my name's Alec. We're the Mushroom Box, and these are the mushrooms we supply. Our goal is to make mushrooms mainstream. <laughs> culture and clean material guarantee free of pathogens and diseases and uh, we were working to help enable this industry and help to grow it into to what we hope to see in the future. How's it guys? Kai here from Endor Sun. Um, joining us at the Cape Town Cannabis Expo. Um, we are here showing our local manufactured LEDs to all walks of life from the uh, tent growers all the way through the, to, to the commercial side. Um, we've been having a wonderful time, wonderful people, really enjoying ourselves and uh, portraying what South Africa can do in terms of LED lighting. our new brand of products. So take a look around. Enjoy.
Tom Berazweni from Zimbo Farmers Support Network. I'm a traditional doctor and also uh, a director for Zimbo Farmers Support Network. At Zimbo Farmers Support Network, we actually started by uh, trying means assisted by others in legal uh, fraternities to stop the spraying which was happening. They're using glyphosate to destroy the farmers, indigenous farmers in Bondoland. So we, we, we won that battle. And the government of South Africa started changing the laws and uh, in a way supporting us, supporting the move, which is not ours, it's for every South African. So at this stage, we noticed that uh, the cannabis industry is developing very fast and we are busy pushing them so that they grow a crop that will compete well with the world market. And we invite everybody to come and assist us who is capable of assisting communities. Thank you very much. from Afrimat Hemp, uh, we're part of the Afrimat uh, group and we manufacture um, process hemp uh, uh, biomass material and also manufacture downstream uh, construction materials in Crete uh, blocks, we formulate the uh, lime binders and also breathable paints and we basically sell the whole hemp uh, system manufactured locally in South Africa and we um, already uh, done a sort of a big project in Cape Town which will be revealed in the media fairly soon. We believe it will be the biggest hempcrete uh, construction in the world. And then uh, yeah, for you guys up in Josie, uh, we're coming to Josie soon. We are going to build a, a house in Rustenburg in the next few months. So uh, keep an eye out uh, and yeah, follow us on Instagram. Happy Madem. Cheers. sales software provider. What does that mean? It means that we help you with all of your cannabis compliance needs. So anything that happens to and around your cannabis, who did what, when they did it, where they did it, how they did it, that all gets recorded, saved in our software, attached to your batch, finished product, that allows you to remain compliant with both your jurisdiction and any international compliance requirements like GMP that you're looking to cover. We'd love to talk to you more. Feel free to reach out to us anytime. Hello! We are the Christiania Seeds, coming from Denmark to visit you, South Africa. Bringing the great strains for the outdoor, indoor, sativa indica, whatever you like to. It's a little free hippie town in Copenhagen, so uh, vibes of the hippies still staying with us. So please visit us. Go. You can find us over there. Cool, thanks. Hey, good afternoon. My name is Michael Jorgensen from uh, Essence Gross. Uh, we are happy to be back in Cape Town at the Cannabis Expo. Uh, Essence Gross, we are about aeroponic growth of cannabis. Uh, we do our cloning in the cloning bedding machine, the HM 2.1. It's a fast machine, so it uh, does uh, cloning in just four weeks and you have veggie plants 30 centimeters tall, transplanting them over to the atrium 4 uh, and they uh, do the blooming in eight weeks. It's a powerful machine that can produce up to five kilograms of cannabis uh, dried plus uh, every uh, year. from the Cannabis Institute and we're live at the Cannabis Expo. Uh, we are an educational institution. We're offering uh, short courses in uh, cannabis, uh, like CBD for pets, uh, CBD for children. Uh, we've got sports recovery short courses and now we've just uh, 
went live with our national certificate um, in the cannabis production. And uh, come down and come and see us here. Thank you very much. Okay, so my name is Myron Cross. I'm the CEO, Chief Wellness Officer and Chief Marketer of Canatrade Africa. We started in cannabis three years ago at the very first expo in 20, uh, 2018. The green side is our uh, retail brand. We open, we have the two green sides. We have the mothership in the suburb of Greenside. We have our first flagship store in Santon. We're glad to announce we're opening a third store in Victoria and that will be in, in June and we'll be opening our fourth store in uh, in Cape Town in around September. Based at the green side, we're a pharmacy and a canaporium. Pharmacy, food as real medicine store, and a canaporium, a cannabis emporium. So we really are a very unique kind of company because we combine cannabis lifestyle and cannabis wellness, and we honestly combine a green lifestyle with green wellness. So if you pop into any of our stores, you'll find a full can canaporium, you'll find a full uh, apothecary, you'll find a diner, you'll find organic vegetables, and you'll find a lot of friendly faces, and we really are here to help you all on your journey to wellness. And please don't stop supporting the cannabis industry. We need you guys. Dispensaries. Um, we've got two dispensaries, one in Durban, one in Johannesburg, and we specialize in natural medicines like medicinal mushrooms, moringa, skeletium, um, CBD, obviously, kratom, um, and we employ doctors to come and help you try and get to the right dose, right extract at the right time to solve your problem. We also do different interesting projects like different mushroom coffees and alcohol alternatives, coffee alternatives. So come and check us out and see how we can help you. Thank you. It's a store at the Cannabis Expo. What we do at Rasta Rica Village is that we bring together different, different brands from South Africa, focusing on women empowerment. We've got women coming from Durban. We've got a house of designs and we've got Indima Wear that come together and make these beautiful products for us. We also care for the environment so much that we recycle and do other products. Most of our products, and we've got, um, not only do we do fashion um, people, our designers, We've got a lady here 
on your side there, her name is Zintumi, she's our media person, she's also one of us. So we've got we are a bunch of women in the cannabis industry hoping to get the best out of the industry. Right now what we're trying to focus on is processing our own fabric and then doing a lot of things. And next um, expo in July, everything goes well, we'll be in Durban and we're hoping to have our own cannabis fashion show where we're going to have wedding gowns, clothes and everything else made out of cannabis. We're also going to be having barefoot sandals made out of cannabis as a way of giving back to our environment. So in West Africa, we do give opportunities. We are sponsored by Mine Records Development Agency. We've got partner, we've partnered with uh, this, um, government institutions like CEDAS, small enterprise development agencies. They are our sponsors. They help us a lot. And um, it's been amazing. It's been amazing. And thanks to the support that we're getting from CEDA and Mine Records Development Agency, that we're able to go around the whole of South Africa and show things. Turmeric is also a natural anti-inflammatory. 100 bucks a bottle, I think it will be cheaper around on there. 